Welcome to IMH. Let's figure out what's in my headphones this week. Made by Nine Tone. We've reached the very first Friday of 2024, which means it's time for me to present the very first releases of this year. But first, let's take a look at the covers. Now it's time to figure out what hides behind them. The genres we're tackling today are pop. You only see what you're looking for. Hip hop. Folk. Indie folk. I wish you had grown up. Finnish hip hop. Check the marks in the timeline to skip to your favorite genre or just sit back and relax because here they come. A Choir of Ghosts is finally releasing his song called The End. I've seen a couple of teasers of it on TikTok. Not only does he post sneak peeks of his upcoming songs there, but also cozy, genuine and good covers like this one. Does that work? Hey. Does it go like that? Is it still recorded? <laughs> Jesus Christ. I don't have no fucking storage after this. Uh, For the love of Christ almighty. I'm the top. You ready? Yeah, please not. <laughs> Okay. I can wait. Every now and then I fall apart And I need you more So go follow A Choir of Ghosts on TikTok. But now, let's listen to the song. Will you be my angel? Could you be a friend? Will you sit and hold me still while I'm staring at the end? Wow. What a nice vibe. I'm not surprised though. I feel like a choir of ghosts know exactly how to provide this vibe. And he does it really, really well. I'll sing alone. I'm going gold. I'll sing alone. Don't worry, no. So this exact part I've heard a lot on TikTok. It's so cozy, but also a bit sad. His voice combined with the sound of the music sounds like he's longing for something, but that he's also okay with not having it. Does that make any sense? Oh, I should have listened to you when you told me to believe and everything we've dreamed of Same kind of green. I'll sing. Oh, the lyrics. He's singing that he should have believed in everything they dreamed of and seen because he's not getting younger and the grass is still the same kind of green. I love that. Oh, oh my God, I love that. Don't worry, no. Hey, 
super cool solo. I'll sing alone, I'm going home. I'll sing alone, don't worry, no. Beautiful, this beautiful. This guy knows what he's doing. This is not a genre I listen to generally, if I'm being real, but I just love how this song sounds. And that's a general pattern when it comes to a choir of ghosts music. So if you love to listen to Falk throughout your daily life, I'm sure you will love all of his songs. Great job. Don't forget to add The End by a choir of ghosts to your playlist if you enjoyed it. <laughs> For a second time around, Lena Cooper and Ryan Colt are back on this show. This time they're here with a song called Hey. Simple as that. Hey. Let's listen to it. Sometimes the sun shines bright. If you just take a moment, might feel a little lighter. If you just step outside and maybe just call your mother and tell her. I strongly believe this will be the perfect song to lighten up your day. The sound seems positive and hopeful, and the lyrics are thoughtful and encouraging so far. It's not so serious that day a good day, the beer will taste the same. Hey, facts. Good day or bad day, the beer will taste the same. You only see what you're looking for It's in the little things outside your door Say like hey, 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 hey Let it out, hey, 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 hey We still woke up today Oh, we still woke up today Even if life feels pointless and awful sometimes All of us watching this still woke up today we sure did. And for that, we're not only lucky, we're also strong. So let's try to make the most out of it because we can. Sometimes the rain is needed if you've let out to try, but don't let all your worries drown all the good in life. Maybe just call your friends and stop acting like the world is gonna end. Oh, stop being sad. Stop being sad, that's so last year. That's a perfect line for the first Friday of the year. It's not so serious. Bad day or good day. Cup noodles taste the same. <laughs> Cup noodles. But yeah, it's true. Cup noodles taste the same too. to that you only see what you're looking for it's in the little things outside your door see like hey 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 we still woke up today you wanted me to smile so i'm smiling <laughs> oh my god and these two <laughs> <laughs> Their artistry go hand in hand and they make so important songs together. If you're out there and feeling a bit down, I hope you can put this song on and just take in what they're saying. What they're singing is true, even if it might seem impossible to some people out there. So send this to someone who needs the inspiration in their life and just listen to yourself for some feel good vibes. It isn't a secret that Lena and Ryan make songs that come from their hearts and songs that actually mean something to them. Therefore, I would love to hear about their favorite parts of the lyrics of this song and what it means to them. Let's see what they have to say. Hi, my name is Lena Cooper and I'm here to talk about my favorite lyrics 
from my new song, Hey, with Ryan Colt. My favorite two lyrics, I couldn't pick one. The first one is, you only see what you're looking for, the main statement of the song. To me, uh, that line means that happiness most of the time is a state of mind if you decide and really put your work into having positive and optimistic thoughts if you decide to see the good if you decide to be happy that is most likely going to happen it's all about how you view things for the most part i think that a lot of the times we tend to not be grateful for what we have and whenever we realize how much we actually have and how happy we actually are it really changes your views on life. Okay, so my favorite lyric from uh, the song, Hey, bad day or a good day, the beer will taste the same. It's relatable to me, it's rel relatable to Lena. And then we switch it up in the second part and say, bad day or a good day, cup noodles taste the same because we we both do the same kind of thing. We eat cup noodles all the time and we drink beer. Um, but that's my favorite lyric because it's so simple and it's literally what we say on a day-to-day -day basis and what we do. Um, but yeah, that's my favorite one. And the second lyric is in the second uh, verse and it goes, um, Oh, stop feeling sad. That's so last year. I just thought that was hilarious. And we just, <laughs> I did that ad lib, that's so last year in a very uh, LA accent because um, a lot of people in LA tend to be uh, extremely positive, uh, like toxic positive almost whenever you're not allowed to feel sad or angry or like negative in any kind of way so they're like oh my god feeling sad is like so last year you should stop just doing that yeah <laughs> i hope you enjoyed this little breakdown um listen to hey thank you so much for inviting us uh to the show once again uh love you thank you <laughs> go add hey by lena cooper and ryan cole to your playlist if you like the song It is time for our first hip hop song of the year. It's made by LJQ and it's called Quit Tweakin'. I also just have to point out that the cover arts of LJQ always look super cool. I just, I love them. Anyhow, let's listen to the song. Catchy beat. Melody. <laughs> the text is a little bit dirty, but it's dirty in a playful way. I take it as she wants him to only spend time with her, so she bribes him with doing dirty things, but he's kind of like, no, I want to make money. He's thinking about money and wants to be on the grind as well, so yeah. Damn, the flow. Let's go. Gotta be careful. Never trust a woman with your heart. She you. Always keep it on the side. Variable. Cali bitch too. So the weed. She can you. Cause a few things, but my bitches get jealous. They want me to they sell these days. I They listen to my music. They comparing all the issues. I'm finna write a book. Make a album. I can sell you. I'm just focused on the pay. I'm just focused on the pay. Money on my mind. is why I stay. Oh, that's smooth. But so he's rapping about a few things that I disagree with. Like that you can never trust a woman with your heart and that you should always keep another woman on the side just in case. I do not like that, but 
at the same time. I don't think I have to be too serious about the lines, you know? I got money in my mind and you ain't bringing no So look what we can do when she said, who you with? She said, I rub your back and suck you fast asleep I said, that's cool and all, but I still need my cheese You better find your common ground for I say peace And leave you knee deep in the streets Awesome. I literally love everything about this song, except for the lines that I talked about earlier. But damn, it's catchy as fuck. Such a vibe. Such a vibe. Don't forget to add Quit Tweaking by LJQ to your playlist if you like the song. We have a first timer on this show representing indie folk. His name is Henry Jack Toll, and the song he released today is called The Catalan. And isn't this cover a true piece of art? I could literally hang this on my wall as a painting. <laughs> Let's see if the song is as artsy as the cover. We met at the Decathlon. You took off amongst the athletes in Paradox. How could you run at 1500 strong? You're yearning after learning My javelin reach your heart Wow, this is truly a unique sound. So he's singing about a decathlon, which is not so surprising since that's the name of the song. I feel like it's quite metaphorical though, but who knows really? Maybe he actually did meet someone at a decathlon. We'll see. Shot put into a record throw, but you fall to pieces when there's no one. Oh God, I wish you hadn't grown up. I'm old and dead unless a doctor shows up. Yeah. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's metaphorical. Everything about the sound and the lyrics seem very deep, so that's just gonna be my assumption from now on. You tell me I'm a champion Undress me by the bed, the camera's on How could I bear my teeth in one more fight? In my dreams I see you holding up a sight know what this is? This is true auditory art. It is so interesting to listen to. I feel curiousness and playfulness in the sound. And when I shut my eyes, it's like I see the colors of a prisma shining over a green landscape with like a big tree and a bunch of butterflies and a little lake. <laughs> Maybe I'm just tripping here, but do you see what I mean, though? Shot put into a record throw, but you fall to pieces when there's no one. Oh God, I wish you hadn't grown up. I'm old and dead unless a doctor shows up. Cool. Very cool. I would probably not put this in my playlist, but I truly did appreciate listening to it here and now. Or do you know what? If I would ever go to a place like the one I described earlier, I will put this one in my playlist. It's like a greenery view, sunbathing date slash picnic type of song to me. <laughs> very, very specific, but yeah. Yeah, it was just so... It was definitely artsy, like the cover of the song. Yeah, definitely. Anyways, since neither you or I know Henry Jack Toll that well, because it's his first time on this show, I think it's a good idea to get to know him some more. Here's him playing the game of If I Were. If I were a color, I would be blue. Always been my favorite color. And I love the album Blue by Joni Mitchell. That's like one of my all-time favorite albums. If I were a song, I would be A Running Start 
by Sufjan. Sufjan Stevens' new album has been an incredible influence on me. Um, and I wish I wrote that song, because it's my absolute favorite. If I were a movie, speaking of favorites, I would be the movie Synecdoche, New York, with Philip Seymour Hoffman. He's my favorite actor ever, and it's my favorite movie of all time. Sometimes I wish I was him, Philip Seymour Hoffman. If I were a quote, that's a really hard one, but it would probably be a beautiful lyric to a song that I love. In my best behavior, I'm really just like him. Look beneath the floorboards for the secrets I have hid. That's from a song by Sufjan Stevens called John Wayne Gacy Jr. I love that line. So that's one of my favorite quotes. If I could be born into another person's body, I'd probably pick Vincent van Gogh and uh, I would just try to not cut my ear off, you know? My favorite type of weather, I live in sunny LA now, so of course I love beautiful sunny weather. But my favorite kind of weather is probably when it's really snowy, because I grew up in New England and in Massachusetts where I grew up. I have so many fond memories of playing in the snow from when I was little. It's so magical when it snows for the first time of the year. If I were a flower, I would be a red, red rose. Red Red Rose is also one of my favorite songs by a band called The Weepies. <laughs> Not to keep bringing it back to music. And then if I was an animal, I'd probably be an otter because they're super chill and super cute and they're just lounging around enjoying themselves all the time. And uh, I want to embody that always in life. If you enjoyed Henry Jack Tall's song, The Catalan, go add it to your playlist right now. A whole new year and a whole new genre. Or, I mean, nothing new about hip hop, but Finnish hip hop. Very, very interesting. The song is made by Walt Miguel and is called Lieki. <laughs> Neither do I know how to pronounce that right or what it means. Now I just have to look at what it means. Let's see. Lieki on fire. Okay, we're gonna be on fire, I see. Let's listen to it. Very angry type of beat. Or like, aggressive attitude. I guess it agrees with on fire, kind of. It's got a really nice voice for rapping and a good flow. It goes well with the aggressive track. Lieki. <laughs> on fire. I'm so curious of everything else he raps about though. Because there's a lot of text. A lot. I definitely gotta ask Walt for a English description. guess what he's rapping about it would be that he's on fire duh <laughs> no but like him being on fire being untouchable and just cool and kind of above everybody else but not in a mean way more in a self-confident way that's just what the sound is given so that's gonna be my guess <laughs> I like 
that little sound to the end. <laughs> no, I can't imitate it. But I always enjoy those small little detail sounds in songs. It makes them catchy to me. <laughs> I don't know why. But now I'm extremely curious to know exactly what he raps about. Let's take a look. What's up, everybody? I'm uh, Walt Miguel. I got a new track coming out this Friday. It's my uh, first ever official release in Finnish, so I'm, I'm super excited about it. Uh, it's a song called Liekki, which uh, literally means flame. So basically the track is about being so hot you can't never stop. And uh, being so on fire, can't nobody deny ya. And Finnish is one of my uh, four musical languages that I use. Um, basically with this song I'm just trying to proclaim that I too want my little piece of the cake of the music industry. So I hope you enjoy it and stay beautiful everybody. Don't forget to add Lieki by Walt Miguel if you liked what you heard. That's all of the songs for this week, which means it's time for me to announce the best song of the episode, according to me. And the winner is... Quit Tweaking by LJQ. Welcome to the playlist, the best songs of IMH 2024. I must say that I had a really hard time to pick the winner of this episode because all of the songs spoke to me, but in so different ways. So I just had to go with the genre that I listen the most to on a daily basis. Anyways, let me know which song that was your favorite. Meanwhile, here's a sneak peek of next week's releases. R&B. I'm trying to focus, baby, I can focus. Piano House. Electric Pop. Dance Pop. 